All right, guys, this is attempt number two. And just to show you, temperature reading on the exhaust pipe is 38, 39 degrees. It still has not started. Still reading pretty low under the engine bay here, 38.1 degrees on the H pop. Now, I do want to inform you guys that I am running a uh, 15W20, I believe, 1530, whatever the <clears throat> um, recommended, <clears throat> whatever the recommended um, oil they call for this truck is what I'm using. I am not a, I don't have a lot of experience with diesel. Let's see what that turbo's reading. Turbo's reading 36, 37 degrees. So let's see if it'll start now. Kind of shocked that it's not since it's 30 degrees. I've never had an issue starting this truck at 30 degrees. I have cycled the glow plugs a few more times uh, since the camera was not running. 12.3. Uh, <laughs> So yeah, I may actually, almost slipped, I may actually have to plug it in. <clears throat> Quite shocking. Like I said, I've not had an issue starting this truck in these temperatures before. So, I don't know, maybe a glow plug issue has finally reared its ugly head, or it could be the uh, fuel has gelled. I do know that diesel fuel can gel uh, at certain temperatures, and it did get down to 7 degrees last night, so um, we're barely at 30 degrees, so I'm kind of wondering if um, the truck just hasn't have t had time to warm up since it's just now 30 degrees. As you can see, it's trying. Ah, ah, did you hear that? It, it almost took off. Let's try this one more time. I really don't want to plug this truck in. <laughs> Alright, let's cycle the plugs one more time, because I'm sure you guys heard that, and I apologize for having you stuck in the windshield like that. <sighs> And I know I'm not waiting the full two minutes. I think that these glow plugs can cycle up to uh, 120 seconds or two minutes. Um, and I'm trying not to kill my battery. It's reading 12.3. Usually it goes down to 11.9 while the glow plugs are cycling. And then it'll jump back up to 12. Uh, 2123 so that is kind of strange that it's not dropping but let's try it one more time come on yeah, as you can see see it dropped down to 12 1 I'm not trying to kill that bat these batteries I could smell all that unburned diesel <laughs> So I think that I may have a gelling issue, possibly not a um, a glow plug issue. See, it's at 12.2 now. And I really don't want to plug in this truck. Because it takes forever for the, um, the block heater to warm the truck up, which is understandable. You don't want... Um, you don't want it to instantly warm up your block, especially in frigid cold weather. That's the easiest and fastest way to crack your block. And huh, last time I checked, I believe these engines around here, they start at like $7,000. So I'm not trying to uh, destroy a $7,000 engine. All right. This is my last attempt before I have to plug it in. What's she going to do? Thank <laughs> you.
Oh, I know you guys heard that. Look at all that. All right. I know I said this is my last attempt, but this is my last attempt because that was beyond promising. Oh, that smells so good. It, the white smoke came over here. Let's try that one more time. Give it a couple seconds. We're sitting at 12.2. So we're okay. I don't like pulling the battery voltage down like this. Uh, but it should be okay. Run it for a few more seconds. It should fire up. And I did check my oil level because I do know that if you have if your oil pr uh, level is too low, then um, it also won't fire the injectors because they run off of the um, oil pressure. All right, let's try this one last time. Come on, come on, bingo! I know. Ooh, he's mad. Oh, I did not like that. There we go, even out. There we go, like I said, raw and in depth. No camera tricks, nothing. Yeah. All right, guys, thanks for watching.